Dave Chappelle, Chris Rock. Oh, Sheen. Okay, so uh, as of what the last, I just started seeing this shit like maybe a little bit over a week ago, but I guess the last week and a half or so, there has been a there has been like a trend of uh, the girls going on TikTok, TikTok and Twitter and such such apps. <laughs> um, basically showing pictures of uh, the tags that they get from the tags that's on the, the clothing items from the Sheen or Shein or however the fuck you say this shit and um, supposedly on the tags to these these shirts and bags and uh, swimsuits and whatever the fuck else Sheen sells there's a message there's like a message an encrypted message not even encrypted but it's like within the like um you know what the what the fabric is made out of and how you're supposed to wash it or dry clean and all this stuff there's there's been like messages saying like help me need your help send help and shit like that so um i don't know how true or how real the shit is uh, but I've been seeing a couple videos of it, so I'm I'm assuming that the shit is real. Um, and so it's like um, every everything on social media is basically saying like uh, you know it's the the people in like the sweatshops or whatnot uh, trying to get help. And my nigga, that shit is wild, bro. Like, um, I don't know what the fuck they expect people to do i guess raise awareness but if not and if the shit is real um what is we supposed to do like <laughs> i mean these shits a lot of these shits is made in um another country so they rules is not like our rules so um what do we do my nigga is my question like uh we supposed to just stop buying shit from over that way or i mean i'm confusion my nigga <laughs> like i really uh it's if they in fucked up situations over there it's it's a terrible thing to be honest with you it, it really is a terrible thing um uh, but at the same time like i said a lot of the shit that we get from over there uh, is is made and manufactured in that way with like sweatshops and underage uh, children or uh, child labor and shit like that. Like I mean, so like I said, the rules is different, the laws is different. So fuck you want me to do about it, bro? Like I hate it for you, I really do. But at the end of the day, my nigga, gas about to be five dollars a gallon, fam. <laughs> I got my own shit to worry about, like. I can't control shit that's going on over here. How the fuck I'm going to control something that's going on over there? Prayers to you. Prayers to us all. But I mean... Oh, fuck you want me to do? Like, shit is, shit is crazy to me because they they keep letting the shit get out. Um, But on the flip side, if that's Shein, Shein's or Shein's way of like uh trying to get a a bud from social media or something my nigga that's the wrong way to fucking go about it you gonna fuck around and lose half your goddamn customers doing that shit like i don't know bro that's some that's some wild shit if you if you think about it that's really some that's really some crazy shit these niggas is calling out for help and niggas is just putting on they fucking uh garments and posting shit on instagram like Sorry, Ling Ling. Oh, that's fucked up. God, that's fucked up. I might delete that. God, I'm not, I'm not posting that. Jesus Christ. That was fucking wild. I need to relax. But yeah, that's some wild shit, bro. Like I said, prayers to everybody, my nigga. Because this it's just some wild shit to be going on out here. Um, But anyways, let me see. 